Hey guys, welcome back to Come Again TV, where all geek culture collides. I'm Shannon, and today we're going to be trying something a little bit different. Uh, I just saw Variant's video on Nightwing, so that gave me an idea. I have Nightwing Year One, all six issues, in my comic book collection, so I'm going to go over them. Today, we're going to be talking about Part 1 of 6, and then maybe another day... We'll do part two of six, and then three of six, and then four of six, five of six, six of six. And then, once we're done with Nightwing year one, we're going to be dipping into Tales of the Teen Titans, The Judas Contract, which is the first appearance of Nightwing. And when we're finished with that, we're going to dip into Nightwing, Alfred's Return. Which, as you guys heard from Variant, um, is the first official Nightwing comic book to kind of test the waters to see if fans were ready for an ongoing Nightwing series. So, with that being said, let's go ahead and take a look at this comic as you can see here this is number 101 nightwing year one part one of six robin's last stand as you can see here batman and robin taking on clayface down in the sewers uh robin's not wearing his normal pixie boot or pixie shoes with the uh green trunks and no leggings He's actually wearing more of a Tim Drake style costume, really. And I guess that's because it's in the middle of a blizzard. He uh, decided to leave the pixie boots at home and uh, dress more warmly. Of course, he's late because he was busy on Titan's business of putting Brother Blood away. Of course, Batman is uh, taking care of Clayface on his own at that point. And Robin gets Clayface to uh, chase him outside where it's freezing cold. And of course, Clay, being what it is, just water and mud, he freezes. Uh, Batman's not too happy with him. He's got a little baby in his hand. Turns out... The baby Batman is carrying there is actually Clayface's child. Uh, apparently, there's a uh, dispute over uh, who gets the child. Uh, and goes back, a little flashback scene um, where Dick's parents get killed. Uh, Batman starts training him, constantly telling him he needs to do better. Here they are at odds. Clayface breaks free from his frozen uh, shell. Uh, he's got a gun. And he tries to fire it. It goes off. Apparently there's some frozen pieces of clay stuck in the chamber. So that uh, he can't really fire it. Robin then tells Batman that uh, no, he's on cleanup. He'll go after Clayface. He needs Batman needs to take care of the baby. And uh, one thing leads to another. I won't go through the entire thing. We'll just skip to the end. Where uh, they're back at the Batcave. Alfred presents Dick with a new costume. Telling him that Robins molt their feathers before becoming full-fledged adults. Do they not? So there's a new costume. He doesn't even get a chance to try it on. Batman sends Alfred upstairs to get them something to eat. And at that point, there's no more silent treatment. Bruce just starts yelling. And throughout this comic, they really, the way they portrayed Batman, I imagined Kevin Conroy saying all of Batman's lines. Just the abruptness of the dialogue and everything. 
Uh, of course, he locks Alfred out of the uh, Batcave so that he can't interfere. And ultimately fires Robin, telling him to leave the new uniform. Um, Alfred finally manages to uh, break open the uh, grandfather clock to uh, get in. And uh, Bruce reveals that um, Dick's been terminated. Um, so that's the beginning of the ser- of this mini series. As I said, it's Nightwing Year One, Part One of Six, uh, by Dixon, Beatty, McDaniel, and Owens. Uh, pretty good read. Uh, I only had issues one through five in paperback format. So last night I went on Comicsology and got the digital copy of Six. So we'll do be doing six, the review of six a little bit differently. The usual format, uh, rather than like this. I'm actually kind of liking this format too. Um, tell me what you guys think of this format. Uh, our new backdrop here. So, <clears throat> I wanted to try it out. This is going to be the backdrop we use for, our, or that I'll use for my toy reviews and pop reviews and whatever else. Um, I've got tons of comics in there I haven't really been able to get to. So, if you like this format, leave a comment below. Let me know, and we'll continue with this format. Uh, whenever I have a digital copy of something, we'll go back to the old format. But when I have a standard paperback, we'll keep it with this format. I'm Shannon for Comageddon TV. Take care, guys. Hey, guys, if you like this video, make sure you smash that subscribe button and click on the little bell to receive notifications on all our upcoming videos. Hit the like button, make sure and leave us a comment so we know how you felt about this video. And don't forget to share with your family and friends. Until next time, I'm Shannon for Come Again, where all geek culture collides.